What's up, y'all? It's your master, Lee. And Lulu. All right, got a recommendation here from y'all for the Bee Gees. And I never heard of the song. Mm. I'm like, oh, of all the big Bee Gees songs, this is it. You win again. <laughs> Apparently it came out in the 80s. So this was a couple decades when, I think that they were the biggest when they were in their 70s. But I'm also reading here that this song top the charts mostly in Europe like UK Ireland Switzerland Norway so maybe that's why I never heard of it maybe mm -hmm. back then I was in Asia actually think about it no no my parents did actually play BG songs that's why I kind of knew a number of their big hits from the 70s but I guess in the 70s we were still in the US mm -hmm. so we were exposed to that music but once we moved to the Middle East and then to Asia uh, Bee Gees well, definitely were not as popular in that neck of the woods. Mm -hmm. So, but you know, someone's recommended it's a live performance. I don't think we've ever seen them perform live, a Dutch television show, and the quality of it looks amazing. So I'm like, oh, you're gonna love this. Oh, mm -hmm. I like the colors already. Uh, the Dutch are into colors. <laughs> so let's check it out. I'm sure. By the way, when you hear some wicked wild stories about Vegas, you gotta check out my channel. And if you want some hotness, check out my fantasy show. Oh, winner, winner, chicken dinner. Oh, this still look young. God. Shouldn't let you kick me when I'm back in my bed. Finding out everybody knows that you've been using me. I'm so frightened. Let me stay around you. But they wanna lift the cover and look inside your heart. We got a little bit more we go. But then it's a lot of fun. Yeah, baby. Yeah, I like it. Oh my god, I really love the song. Never heard of it either, huh? Never. Yeah. And the whole time, I'm just admiring his hotness, his sexiness, and his So sometimes swing. life is unfair. I, that's all I say. Like, you know, there's three brothers. I think everyone already knows this, and, and maybe what I'll just finally say I'm like, you know, everyone's got talented. All three of them at least can sing, right? Because otherwise they'd be leaving a brother home, right? That would suck. Maybe there was another brother and he actually couldn't sing. But it was pretty evident, like, one of them looked out in the gene pool because he's wearing tight tight ass clothes and pants and, then, and, and the then, other dude uh, the other brother is like wearing the loosest clothes and then, like to cover himself up. i'm like that's so unfair <laughs> that's that's the story of my life
That's a catchy song. Hello, this is Paul McCartney. Oh, and that's you're Paul McCartney. Europe's number one rock show, Countdown. Were they literally on the same oh. show together? Oh, my God. Yes. Can you imagine being in the audience <gasps> and go like, hey, by the way, we have guest Bee Gees and Paul McCartney from the Beatles. I'm like, what? Wow. That, that's pretty awesome. <laughs> like the end, you like threw me off there. I didn't realize that. Right? Oh my God, they you must, must be so lucky to be there. This show must still be on because <laughs> they just posted this uh, last year and uh, the show is called Countdown. So it, I guess it's a countdown, maybe the top songs. I actually, at first I thought maybe they were performing for New Year's and it's like a countdown, the ball would drop. <laughs> and then I'm like, nothing's happening here and they're too chill for New Year's. So yeah, yeah no, it's it's the show and oh. it's an, and it's they're updating still so right it, it must be like all the big stars from around the world the footage is amazing wow, wow. it's yes. so it is. you really can't can. even tell that's from 80 I, honestly I, if you didn't tell me when this was i would not have wow guessed. i think what maybe would have given it away is uh well most of the Bee Gees music is very 70s ish yeah it's very old sound mm. very distinct of that era but this one has a much more 80s pop sensibility you kind of hear the evolution of their music, and now it's very, it's very poppy. Actually, it's I can very see poppy, why very, it was um, you know, like a having a great day to boost your. Oh, that's day. a good point. It's, it's almost like if you were like the minute you get out of your house, an intro to movie. You're like, "Hello, neighbor," and you're walking down the street. Oh, man, again, like that, right? Yeah, sunshine. Yeah, walking on the sidewalk. Everyone's waving at you. Yeah, I I can see that, baby. Yeah. I love it. Or it could be a great casino song. Every casino plays a song. You win again. <laughs> yeah. Actually, that part. that part made me go like, Vegas has all sorts of themed slot machines. There mm. should have been a Bee Gees slot machine called mm. You Win Again. Mm. And it's like progressive. You win, and then boom, you win again. That was a great recommendation. Yeah, I thanks for recommending new. this song. Just, a lot of these shows, once they're broadcasting, it's semi live, you know what I'm saying? Because they don't want, you know, people to mess up and have to mm, retake mm. it. So I, I don't know. I don't know if it's like that. They honestly I don't think they need to because they just sound so let's say they sound so good when they just talk. They don't even have to like how much more in the Exactly, thing. right? When they sing, it's like of course they know how to sing. But when they talk already, I'm like, damn, you sound good not even singing. <laughs>